With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, welcome to doubtnet. So our question here is, select the correct statement regarding population interaction. So our statements are commensalism when none of the interacting population affect each other. Second statement is symbiosis when the interaction is useful to both the population. Third option is proto-cooperation when one population. And fourth option is amensalism when the interaction is useful to the population. So, we have to identify the correct statement here. We have to find which statement is correct here. So, population interaction means the interaction between two population means how two population are interacting. Okay, we have to consider here two population. So, let's consider the population interaction. Here will be our population interaction. Okay, here we will write the interaction part and here we will write the species. Okay, so species is here. Now, we have to consider two species. Hence, we will write A and B here. Okay, so we will take two species which is known as species A and second one is species B. So, first considering the Commensalism. Okay, interaction will be commensalism. Now we are considering commensalism. So in this what happens? One species is benefited but other species has no benefit nor loss. So plus is denoting benefit here and zero is responding to no benefit, no loss. So, in commensalism, what will happen? There, one species will be benefited, but other species have no benefit, no loss. So, example can be big plants. Okay, so big plants are nourishing small plants. Big plants are providing nutrition to small plants. So, what is happening here? Small plants are getting benefit, while the big plant is neither benefited nor in loss. So, that's why it is said that it is commensalism means one is getting benefited but other has no benefit, no loss. Second, we will consider symbiosis. Okay, symbiosis is there and symbiosis is also known as mutualism. Why mutualism? Because in this both the species are benefited. So, it is denoted by plus plus means the both species are getting benefited. We can take the case of algae. Example will be algae and fungus. In this case, what is happening? Algae is providing the nutrients to fungus and fungus is providing protection to the algae. So, in this case, both are getting benefited here. That's why it is said symbiosis or mutualism. Now, our third condition is proto-cooperation. Proto-cooperation. What happens in this case? In this case, one species is benefited and other one is also benefited. So, proto-cooperation is also the case in which both the species are getting benefit. Okay. So, our last case was amensalism. We will consider Amensalism. Amensalism is denoting that one is getting loss and other has no benefit, no loss. So, minus is denoting here loss and zero is denoting here no benefit, no loss. Example you can take as penicillium fungus. Okay. So, what happens in penicillium fungus kills bacteria. So, what is happening here? Bacteria is getting lost. So, bacteria is killed. That's why it is getting lost. So, what will be the, our correct option here? It is said that symbiosis when the interaction is useful to both of the population.
so this is the correct option because in symbiosis we saw that both the population is getting benefited means both of the population are getting benefit so our option 2 will be the correct option okay i hope your doubt is clear thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today